So the key things to know when flying during a pandemic, do not fly if you have coronavirus symptoms or have had any in the last 10 days. If you should be self-isolating because someone you live with has or has had symptoms recently, or if you've been in close contact with someone you know has had coronavirus. If that doesn't apply to you, then head to the airport. Don't go into the terminal unless you're a passenger or dropping off someone vulnerable. The fewer people around, the less a virus can spread. Social distancing rules still apply, whether you're on the ground or at 40,000 feet. So keep your distance from others. Checking in online and using machines avoids unnecessary face-to-face -face contact. Putting bags in the hold and avoiding hand luggage can speed up boarding and disembarking. So there's less chance of the virus spreading. Don't walk around the airport if you don't need to. Clean your hands thoroughly after touching anything someone else may have touched and wear a face covering, though some people are exempt. And if the police or border control or security ask you to remove your mask so they can ID you, then you should do as they say. Cabin crew, please be seated. In the air, keep wearing your face covering unless you're eating or drinking. Remain seated as much as possible, keep your distance and tell the cabin crew if you feel unwell. Before you get on your return flight, if you're flying into the UK, you need to get tested for coronavirus and get proof that it was negative. That is, unless you're coming from Ireland, the Channel Islands or the Isle of Man. If you don't have proof, you may be fined £500 when you land. You'll also need to fill in a passenger locator form, giving details about where you've been. Again, unless you've come from somewhere else in the UK, the Channel Islands, the Isle of Man or Ireland, and were there for more than 10 days. If you don't, you may not be let in, and you could be fined up to £3,200. Leave the airport as quickly as possible, and then, depending where you've flown in from, you may need to put yourself in quarantine. Stay at home or in your hotel room for 10 days. Get everything delivered to you. No visitors. In England, you can pay to have a private test after five days. If it comes back negative, you're free to go. But otherwise, if you break quarantine, you could be spreading COVID-19. And you could be fined as much as £10,000 for every time you break the rules. That's a holiday expense no one wants.